Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this is a breaking news update. It's your boy Dave Neal, stand-up comic and host of Bachelorette Recap A Guys Review. And as you can see in this graphic, we are talking about Michelle Young. She has been spotted at a baseball game today, throwing out the first pitch. We're going to dive right into that update. Of course, this is a spoiler for her season of The Bachelorette, which is now filming in Minnesota after a brief stint in Palm Springs. Let's jump right into it. Hit the like button and comment. Let me know what you think Reality Steve posted. Filming update. Michelle is having a one-on-one date today at the Twins Rays game. Don't know who it is with yet. Game is at 2.10 p.m. Eastern time, so I'm guessing there will be plenty of picks out there once they get to the stadium, and you better believe there are. Now, now that we are starting to film outside of the bubble, as it were, it's time to pop the bubble's fourth wall and get into the nitty-gritty of what the fans saw. So let's jump right into that. If you don't want any of these spoilers, by all means, these aren't season-ending spoilers. Chances are she's probably two weeks into her season, so not necessarily a finalist contender. But um, let's hop right into it. So, Michelle's one-on-one date today at Target Field for the Twins Rays game is with Joe Coleman, a Minnesota native. Joe Coleman, 28, Minneapolis, Minnesota. So let's see what this commotion is all about. Get right into this here. Joe Coleman, a... I mean, it's good that she's seeing guys from her hometown. Let's see if they're going to give them the hometown advantage. Michelle and one-on-one date. Joe at Twins game today, throwing out the first pitch. There they are, folks. The Twin Cities themselves. She's looking very gorgeous from afar. Whoever took this had the cheap seats. They clearly are not in a committed relationship. They wanted cheap beer. Going to cheap day out. So they're in the nosebleeds, as it were. So they're getting their shirts ready, getting ready to go. Your boy Dave Neal here is commentating all this for us. Clearly, the cameras that we're looking at are bachelorette cameras they've got a close-up shot on her a close-up shot on him a medium shot of the both of them and we cut to the jumbotron there they are getting ready to go so we're gonna have plenty of film coming from the you know dozens of spectators throughout the game now they do the first pitch usually somewhere around half an hour before game time sunday afternoon everyone's getting back from sunday brunch or church so not many people in the audience the Bachelorette Twins territory zone. Shelly Oh, they're not going to be throwing from the mound. Katie Thurston threw it from the mound. So if she throws a strike, they have to kiss. These are the parameters. Let's see how it goes. She's an athlete, I think a former basketball player. Baseball, if you're a if you're not a baseball player, it can be very hard to throw a strike. Let's see what happens here. Nothing like the choppy Instagram stories. What exactly is a Minnesota twin anyway? What's it? What's this mascot? Here she goes. Today, Michelle. No one cheers. If she throws a strike, Joe gets a kiss. Here we go, folks. Michelle Young toes the rubber, goes for the pitch. The 0-1 delivery. It is a high and away, we'll call it a strike. Close enough. Pretty good toss there, and now they kiss. They're close up. We don't have that. We're going to have to wait till the season to get that close up, but there they are, embracing, kissing in a on-field fantasy suite. Let's just say the mound isn't the only bump on the infield. Looking at you, Joe. Are you just happy to be playing baseball? Did you get to second base, or are you just hanging out on the mound all day? So there they are, folks. Not much to see there. Clearly horrible quality video. But uh, it is what it is. You know, uh, when Katie Thurston did this, it was after her season had ended, so it wasn't uh, any sort of spoiler. But clearly the – all right, let's cut back here. So clearly what happened was – cut out of that clearly what happened this is of course mike fleiss had posted this uh, the creator of the bachelorette he posted this on location with the bachelorette just a week ago so she's ready to go uh but uh you know what's interesting is they wanted to uh make sure that nobody would know what they were doing so they went to one of the least um attended baseball games 
in the last century. There's literally 50 people in the audience. 45 of them probably work for Bachelorette. So I don't know. We got the info. Thank you. Shout out to Reality Steve for those clips. Let me know what you guys think. Will you be following Michelle's season? Will it be a season where we sort of like, um, are you, I guess, I guess the question is this. Um, if you watched Katie Thurston's season, Will you be watching, and please leave a comment, will you be watching Michelle's season? If you didn't watch Katie Thurston's season, will you be watching Michelle's season? It seems like the summer might have been a lower rating. Obviously, there was a lot of people that were saying, I'm not going to watch because of Chris Harris, and that was its whole, that was a you know completely different scenario. The rest of the people, you know, they have their lives. School's out for the summer. We're going to go get ice cream. We're not just going to be sitting at home. Now, this is going to be coming out, I believe, mid-October, and it's going to take us all the way up to right before Christmas. So the question is, will people be you know back at home more as the fall season hits, having pumpkin spice lattes and hanging out with The Bachelorette? My guess is there will be a nominal increase in people watching the show uh, over what there was this summer and we'll get back to like our standard programming maybe it'll be the same levels of Tasha and Claire although it's hard to tell because Tasha and Claire was still in a more of a pandemic vibe not to say that it's not full-blown delta mode out there it is absolutely but are people getting back to their regularly scheduled lives that's what we're gonna have to see so anyway Michelle Young, um, she's probably, I'm guessing she had it started about about 25 guys. It's probably down to 18 to 20. And then we'll see where it goes from there. Leave a comment. That's your uh, breaking news update for the day. Michelle Young throwing out first uh, first pitches and uh, taking first kisses. All right, folks. We'll talk to you later. Bye now.